All right, guys, so we got a an issue on the truck. Surprise, surprise. This is the message that First popped up. thing that out. happened is I got increased D-rate. And it said three hours, and then it went away, then it said four hours, and away, then it popped up back again. Then it stayed there. Then I got this message. SCR system alter, altered or fault detected. I've been trying to do manual regen, and I'm not getting anything happening. So what I've been able to look up so far, I've only done about 10 minutes of research, but it seems like I must have a short, um, more than likely above that SCR temp sensor down by the DPF, or possibly up underneath the hood. Some There's also a fuse up underneath there I'm gonna check. So um, hopefully I can fix those, hopefully I got the parts. Um, I'm at a rest stop and I'm at the end of my hours. Um, and I got about three hours to make it home tomorrow. Well, no, I gotta drive another six hours actually from here. So anyways, um, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna check those places out, see if I can find the issue and I'll let you know where it's at. on the back of the DPF here and it's pointed that way and it's just spraying hot to death all that way so I think my SCR is all messed up here and um, I got that leak which is melting everything so I'm gonna try to patch it up your update I was able to loop it 60 miles Klamath Falls and we have one arterial stent here on the death line the heated death line and then we have a bunch of very effective duct tape and zip ties to repair all of our melted airlines um, so what had happened was that exhaust leak developed here and blew all that hot air here melted to these airlines and melted a big ass hole right here in the death line. So this stuff is holding up very well. I got some more exhaust tape just in case. I'm gonna put another layer on it because I still got 300 miles to get home. And I got some self-adhesive tape that's gonna go here and here to make sure we don't have any more leaks. 